Greetings on my little subs and subs to be. I am Master Dominic, and it's my absolute pleasure to welcome you back to Dark Souls Part 39. We're actually making progress in Sen's Fortress. Okay. So we took out two. I think it was two. Yeah. Titanite demons. So hopefully we'll be able to take out even more of them in that lower level. Because I don't know if there is some kind of secret doorway that will help me get through there in that lower area or not. What I do know is those demons are worth a good amount of souls, and I enjoy killing them. Oh, thank you god, they're actually gone for good. So just drop right down here. And heal up. Oh, this is so much better. Fucking electro snakes. God, it's such weird noises sometimes. Okay, grab my souls. And now do battle. This gigantic asshole. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sorry. Huh? Hey, puzzle. Jeez, he almost got me. It doesn't look like he can fit through that doorway. Yes, there is now a cat in my face. He, like, knows just when to start charging that attack, so as soon as I come around the corner, he hits me. Damn it. This game is a matter of patience and timing. You would not believe. Patience I have, but timing, not so much. However, the luck of a fucking leprechaun that has just, like, stolen a unicorn's fucking horseshoes that I out have. God damn it, Fuzzle. Fucking cat scratching at my foot. Come on. Damn. Oh. Luck like you wouldn't believe right there. All the goddamn luck. Almost had one. God, I have 9,000 souls? Now, something I think only 4,000 of those are from killing Titanite demons. The other 5,000 are from killing those same two snake guys over and over. Gotta be a trick I'm not seeing. Take him out, take him out. Shit. And I hit the wrong button again. <laughs> Love the AoE damage. And burn. Okay. Maybe I can just run past that last Titanite Demon now. Because 
Actually, is it the last one, or was there another one past it? I don't remember. Whatever. I'm gonna run past him and see what I can find. Because I feel like there should be more to this place. Shit, he's just going straight for the jumps this time. <sighs> Giant demonic assholes. Okay, so yeah, there's one more over there in the distance. Oh! I know where that is. I know what room they're under. Hmm. I'm gonna go down there and recover my souls. There has to be something. You know, I think I just fucked up that time, because I can run past them. I know I can. First time I went down there, I just lost my shit and just started running in every direction. Oh, f fucking answer. And I hit the wrong button again! I enjoy doing that quite a bit. It, it's a favorite hobby of mine to hit wrong buttons. Okay. I seriously wish I could disable these stupid traps. They just find, like, some kind of centralized room that runs all this shit and just break it. I have to say, though, I'm really hoping there's some kind of little doorway down here that I didn't see. Just because it is so much easier, like, going through this lower area than to go through the upper one. Shit! Grab him, grab him, grab him! Okay, Serpentine, Serpentine, Serpentine. Shit! There isn't a door. So this area is just a place to farm Demon Titanite. From the four fucking Demon Titanite things that are here. Ooh! That was some Matrix shit right there. Okay, so, there's no point to this place, other than to get, you know, fucked over by some demons, or to get their Titanite. Unless there's a illusory wall that I'm not going to find, because I'm not sticking around to deal with that bullshit. Right, damn it. So, that means I have to go this way to move forward. That's at least more than I knew before. I am used, so used to putting up a shield or something right there. Shit! God damn it! Fucking auto lock on bullshit! Ugh. Now they actually know I can drop down here. Just fucking aboard. The auto lock on, like, immediately switched over to the Electro Snake when I moved forward. So since I was on the edge of the bridge, it just sent me falling right off. Hmm. 
That actually gives me an idea. So I can lock on to him from the bridge. Come on, you did it just as... Do not dick with me. Oh, so I can hit him from down here. I'd have to be extremely careful not to get knocked off. Because I think I hit less... Uh, the fall would kill me at my current level. But that'll make it so much easier to get past this bridge. So now I can just walk through these blades carefully instead of having to rush through them. Dodge left. Oh yeah, I didn't even trigger that trap that time. Yeah. Yeah, I thought I knew where this place was. Okay, take out this snake dude. Just because I can. Hold still long enough to die. Take death like the man you likely once were. Since I think the lore behind the uh, man serpents is that they used to be men that were turned into monsters by Seath the Scaleless. What we saw in the opening cutscene. Shit. Seat the Scaleless was a dragon born without scales, so he didn't have the immortality of a normal dragon. As such, he betrayed the real dragons in order to kill them all off, just so that way they wouldn't be assholes to him anymore, I guess. And then, because he helped them, Wynne gave him free reign to do whatever the hell he wanted. You know, he was like, you helped us kill all the other dragons, so we're the only, you're the only actual dragon we're going to let live. And he gave him, like, a whole fucking library to try and research immortality. You know, because he wanted to be immortal, like the other dragons were. And the man serpents were, like, a result of all his crazy-ass experiments. Okay, that was a close one. You're just gonna let the next boulder pass before moving forward. Run like hell. Damn it! I got caught on the wall. Ugh. Maybe it'd be worth it to upgrade my armor just a little bit. Just so I don't take as much of a fucking hit. And <laughs> oh, that's funny. Well, hello again. You see, need anything? Nope, not reinforced. Reinforced armor. He requires. God, requires Twinkling Titanite for the... Okay, so for the Crimson Gear, I won't be able to up it. But for my helm and gloves, I will be able to boost those. I just gotta get some souls. I'll be seeing you there. And I just realized something. Oh boy, did I just realize something. Okay, inventory. Come on, come on. 
Yes! I have two big ass souls that I can pop. One? Three thousand. Nice. Well, uh, you need any Okay. Reinforce armor. Okay, uh let's see. It looks like between the two. Um Right. The gloves have a lower physical defense. So I'll boost them first. Okay, and it's exactly the same between them, so boost this one so it'll be plus one. Then the helm would require two sh okay. Okay, exactly the same again, so just boost the helm again. Okay, it looks like it's just going to keep doing that, so I'll just keep switching between the helm and the gloves back and forth. Ooh, that requires large tightening shards. I'll have to go back and look at old episodes to figure out how to farm those, but I'm pretty sure I can. Okay, now they each require more large Titanite than I have. And I'm not touching the Crimson Robes, because Twinkling Titanite's rare as shit. Don't get yourself killed. Neither of us want to... Okay, there. Much better armor right now. Okay, so hopefully that'll help me in the next episode. So, thank you all so much for watching. I had an awesome time, and I hope you did too. If you liked this video, please subscribe and hope to see every last one of you in the next video. Goodbye.